water. Luxury watchmaker Patek Philippe gets a lot of shine in hip hop. Artists from Beyonce to Migos have all name dropped the brand. Although Audemars Piguet, Hublots, and Rolexes get plenty of shout outs too, 2017 was definitely the year of Patek Philippe. A third of the songs on the Billboard Hot 100 in 2017 included a Patek reference, and the trend continues in 2018 with 13 songs charting so far. Migos' 2018 Culture 2 references the high-end watch 28 times, with 24 references from Offset alone. So what's the hype? Patek Philippe is a high-end Swiss watch manufacturer known for its intricate designs and traditional craftsmanship. Patek Philippe has been lacing royal family members for over a century, but the watches are rare items. Fewer than one million have been made since 1839. It takes over a thousand watch school trained employees to make one exclusive piece, and only 50,000 are made each year. On top of that, each of those watches can take anywhere from nine months to more than two years to make. So how much will a Patek cost you? You'll have to cough up at least five grand for older pre-owned models, but the most expensive Patek sold to date was auctioned for $24 million. We spoke to the people over at Icebox in Atlanta, one of hip hop's go-to spots for jewelry, and got some insight on Patek Philippe's biggest styles and trends. Patek Philippe beats out other brands like Audemars Piguet and Rolex as the most popular luxury watch. Plain, iced out, and two-tone Pateks are common among these watch-loving artists, and the Nautilus seems to be the most popular model. Hip-hop continues to be a trusted compass of the culture. These Patek addicts don't hesitate to flex their latest obsession, and we can count on their lyrics to know what they're on next. Yeah, I'm a king face, my time. Paddies on paddies on paddies on paddies. Oh, okay. 